Hi everybody, welcome back to Chow Home. In this example, I want to demonstrate how to integrate Ansible and Jenkins. We're gonna see how to execute Ansible playbooks from Jenkins using a plugin. Okay, and we do this example using a pipeline job. For the purpose of this demonstration, I have Jenkins and I have Apache. This is where I'm going to execute the Ansible playbook. All right. And I do have a sample Ansible uh, project inside my GitHub. So we'll go over this when we go and execute the code. I say step one, I want to install Ansible on my Jenkins box. So I am trying to install Ansible on uh, Amazon Linux. Let me try with Ansible 2. Alright, so we need to first enable uh, EPEL. After that, let's give it a try. Yes, now our uh, M repository is able to figure out Ansible. Let's install it. Okay, so that's step one. And step two is let's install Ansible plugin in Jenkins. I'm inside Jenkins uh, dashboard. Okay, from Jenkins homepage, uh, click Manage Jenkins followed by manage plugins under available let's search for ansible plugin right so select this guy install without restart it got installed successfully let's go back and uh, we need to configure the Jenkins installation path under uh, global tool configuration. So click on manage Jenkins, global tool configuration. So Ansible. Give descriptive name. So it could be any any name and the path to Ansible executable folder we can get that from a Jenkins machine where Ansible is installed see I should not copy that uh, exe up to exe I should copy the folder where Ansible executable is present then click save so next step would be let's create new job pipeline hit ok so let me put the script in line so once we are done with the script right I will keep it inside my repository and you guys can refer that. So I am writing declarative pipeline. In step one, I want to clone my Ansible repository. So let's take help of uh, pipeline syntax. Let's use git repository URL because it's public repository. I don't have to put the credentials. It's getting failed because on my Jenkins machine, git is not installed.
all right let's make sure it is there now that error has gone get the pipeline script copy that so paste it here so that is step one and uh, as a second step I want to execute Ansible playbook so let's go to pipeline syntax so we install Ansible plugin we see that step visible in uh, pipeline syntax generator the tool name we configured under global tool configuration Ansible 2 uh, playbook file path in workspace which is going to be apache.yml so inventory file path in the workspace even inventory I have it part of my uh, github project dev.inv SSH connection credentials uh, like when I execute this playbook it's going to execute on uh, this group so inside inventory I have that group configured with one IP address now I need to provide SSH credentials for connecting to this machine with this user ID and after connecting it's going to execute the playbook which installs Apache web server there so add select Jenkins SSH username with private key ID username is ECT user so I need to take the private key for uh, connecting to my Apache machine so that private key is used here you can check that app key which is uh, sitting on my laptop okay so what I have to do now I need to uh, select enter directly copy the private key content from my uh, local uh, file system put it here under my downloads app key dot pem let me open that with uh, some editor take this so click add provide that key and say add again select that one so the executable file path is picked from here Ansible 2 the playbook we want to execute the inventory file which contains manage node details and SSH credentials for connecting to manage node so these things I just want to leave default values uh, even disable this host key checking otherwise it fails all looks good uh, click uh, generate pipeline script copy this go back and uh, put it over there so when I execute this playbook it will clone this repository fine uh, so on to our local Jenkins workspace we will have these files right let me open apache.yaml uh, it's going to install httpd it's going to start and enable uh, that apache server and it's going to put index.html onto that apache server it, it's going to copy index.html from our local workspace it's here okay so go there save okay and uh, build and wait for the output 
let's open console output it's cloning right and yes it's executing ansible playbook on web servers group it's successfully installed let me go back to our manage node take its public ip yes so the sample application deployed through ansible playbook is up and running that's all from this demonstration thanks for watching